sad. It is sad that you know this could possibly come about. That common sense never prevailed um, long before this the proceedings. But I know you know now is not the time to sort of to look at it. I think you look at the world in general. The things are changing, and it's just. Um, for me, it's just very sad, but I think... Um, you've won the case, but you've, you've lost a lot, haven't you? I've lost everything. 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 Financially, everything. I have been um, completely on the bottom. You've not been able to work? Not been able to work for two years. years. For two years. No contacts. Friends have gone away. Family. Uh, uh, you know, my, my children, my young children, you know, have had things to deal with that they should never be put under. You're a fighter, you'll try and fight your way back now, eh? I'm Glen McCrory, I'm from the northeast, and I will be back. It's getting to the point, isn't it, where you can't even shake hands with somebody without being charged? Absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, you, you, you were there, you were party to, to what went on. It is a beggar's belief that, that something in this day and age, can, in this country, can possibly happen, that somebody can mistake it. Uh, uh, being friendly, being nice, um, they can mistake that. It's, it's, it's very sad. It's very, very sad. And, you know, we just got to, as a community, as a country, we've got to learn to be nice to each other and we've got to learn to love one another.